Today, sir, what I learned from Module 10 are all about network layer protocols and internet protocol. The important points from this lesson are the internet protocol was designed as a protocol with low overhead. It provides only the function that are necess necessary to deliver a packet from a source to a destination over an interconnected system of networks. The communication between networks are called routing. The one who provides services to exchange the individual pieces of data over the network between identified and identified end devices we call as the network layer or OSI layer 3. And to complete this end-to-end -end transport layer 3, layer 3 uses four basic processes. First is addressing the network layer provides a mechanism for for these end devices, each individual pieces are being directed to an end device. Each device has its own unique address. And in an IPv4 network, if the network address is added to a device, the device is then being referred to as a host. The second process are encapsulation. The network layer must provide encapsulation. Third is routing. The layer provides services to direct these packets to their destination. And the last process is decapsulation. If the address is correct, the packet is decapsulated by the network layer and the layer for video contained in the packet is passed up to the appropriate service at transport layer. The network layer also have three basic characteristics. These are connectionless, best effort, and media independent. Connectionless means that sending a data to someone without notifying the recipient in advance. Second is the best effort service unreliable means to transport the packet between the host while placing as, as little burden on the network as possible. Third is media independent. It is the responsibility of OSI data link layer to take an IP packet and prepare it for trans transmission over the communications medium. An IPv4 protocol defines many different fields in the packet header. These fields contain binary values that that the IPv4 service refers reference as they as they for forward packets across the network and these fields are the following IP source address contains a 32-bit binary value that represents the packet source network layer host address next is IP destination address contains a 32-bit binary value that represents the packet source network layer host address and then next is time time to live or TTL is an 8-bit binary value that indicates the remaining life of the packet. Next is type of service TOS contains an 8-bit binary value that is used to determine the priority of each packet. Next is protocol. Any protocol means enable the network layer to pass the data to the appropriate upper layer protocol. Next is the next is fragment offset identifies the order in which to place the packet fragment in the reconstruction and that is what i'm i've learned from lesson 12 or module 12